from the students of Penn State Meteorology. Here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, State College. I'm student meteorologist Kyle Eck here with your Tuesday afternoon Campus Weather Service forecast. Now yesterday, we were haunted by clouds and rain showers, and unfortunately, it's happening for us again today. Here at the Hub Robinson Center, very overcast skies with the temperature already getting to near 60 degrees at this hour. Across western portions of Pennsylvania, along the Allegheny Plateau, again, mid-50s to low 60s, this is warm for us compared to this time of the year. And again, across the eastern portions of Pennsylvania, very warm conditions as the way goes. 64 in Allentown and Harrisburg, 66 as you head southeast towards Philadelphia. Now, how much longer for us are we going to be seeing this warm weather last? Well, according to the Climate Prediction Center, we have another 6 to 10 days to see these anomalous temperatures. Over the eastern portions of the United States, where we're seeing these orange and red shaded colors, that gives us a good indication that we're going to be seeing very warm conditions compared to average, which this time of the year means 60s and 70s for us in Pennsylvania. Currently on clouds and radar and satellite, we have some spotty clouds and rain showers, so we can't ditch the rain showers or the umbrellas just yet, excuse me. Over towards the west in the Midwest, we have high pressure systems situated. That starts to move its way on eastward over the next day or so, and that greatly impacts our weather heading into the middle and late portions of the week. Let's time things out for you. Throughout the rest of the day today, we start clearing out a little bit, but we still see some clouds trying to make their way through the central portions of Pennsylvania. They'll start to clear out overnight, and while this one graphic does show a lot of cloud cover, I'm thinking a lot of this is going to be in the form of fog. So do watch out as you head off to your 8 a.m. classes or if you're driving off to work early tomorrow morning. Luckily, sunshine burns that off throughout the day and high pressure settles in, and we clear out very nicely by tomorrow at 5 o'clock. So we have another few days in store for our very nice conditions as well. High pressure takes a strong hold over the eastern United States by Friday morning. Very little in the way of cloud cover for state college, so it's going to be very nice for us there. A southerly flow of wind on Saturday comes ahead of our next rainmaker. You can see that right here along the Great Lakes region, we do see a southerly flow of wind giving some more humidity and warmth as well, so we do not cool off by any means there. But before all that, we have one more dreary day to get through before we see the sunshine return. The forecast high for today, 61 degrees, with spotty showers being possible. Tonight, we clear out somewhat with a low of 46 degrees, but some of us, especially in the lower elevations, could wake up tomorrow to some patchy fog, so be mindful of that. For tomorrow, throughout the rest of the day, temperatures will be getting to near 61 degrees again with abundant sunshine as high pressure takes hold. Over the next seven days, we increase temperatures throughout the 60s as high pressure takes a strong hold for us throughout the late portions of the week. Temperatures climbing to near 70 degrees by Saturday, and then for Sunday, we get to turn the clocks back one hour. So we get an extra hour of sleep, but we do lose an hour off sunset. So now sunsets are gonna be happening near five o'clock in the evening. By Monday, we start to see our next rainmaker start to move through as temperatures hold near the middle 60s. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm Kyle Eck. Have a great day.